All right. All right. It's it's like Halloween. Okay. And you go trick or treating. And you know the houses that give away the full size candy bars? Well, you went to the wrong house this time. Because this is the fun size equivalent of a 1911 A145. N32. Isn't this thing adorable? This is a cool gun, all right? I got this off a of gun broker and I was actually hoping to be outbid because I'm like, oh, that's, you know, it's a, it's a llama, it's a Spanish gun, they're no good. Well, it turns out actually, I don't know how I got that in my mind that Spanish guns were no good because this thing is a very good quality gun and I'm like, wow, this is fantastic. Um, it is a cute as can be this thing is just like I said fun size uh, let's go ahead and uh, just put this slide back we've already dropped the mag let's check out that chamber no ammunition anywhere near me um, let's drop that slide let's check out this trigger this trigger is just fantastic let's see here oh grip safety grip safety oh just oh, it's just boom oh man out of all the 32s I have so far that are single action, this is by far the nicest trigger. Okay, it's just it's just fantastic. And look, look, of all the little uh, single actions that I have, uh, this is definitely by far the best sights. Um, yeah, I'm very impressed. So, I did a versus of single action, single stacks, where the Beretta Puma 71. So it's the champion. Now the champion's going to have to defend its title because I have a Beretta 1935, the daddy of the Puma, and now I have this Llama, and uh, it's definitely, definitely time to have a rematch. And I'm looking forward to it. I'm still going to do the uh, double action communist block uh, Walther inspired pistols. I just need to get some time to have a couple days at the range. Um, and I just haven't had that happen yet. Uh, plus, it'd be fun if I could get some of my buddies to go to the range with me um, or meet some people there that share the same interests. So, yeah, if you happen to be uh, in the uh, King or Pierce County area and, you know, you're into this stuff, let me know. Um, anyways, um, this, like I said, is a sweet little gun. And uh, if you ever get a chance to uh, get your hands on one of these, uh, so far, yes. Uh, after range day, I'll know more, but uh, there's nothing about how it's handled so far that tells me this is a bad quality gun. There's just, it's tight, it just feels good, the metal's good, it's just good! Okay, so, happy as can be there, and um, I, will, I will let you know the results, hopefully within a couple of weeks. Uh, it's really hard to say, but I'll do my best. Anyways, have a good weekend, bye.